Hello everyone, it's Geisha. Welcome back. Today I'm going to show you a quick video about how to make a simple embellishment to put on your card or a tag or the front of your journal. This is made using the inside of an envelope. This one has a kind of checkered pattern and here I have one with all kinds of stripies. This looks really nice. And today I am going to use my one inch hole punch. But if you don't have one of those, grab like um, a glue stick, put it on your envelope and trace around and cut it out. And for this one I've used eight circles and here I've used close to 12. Now this one was made with my glue stick. It's a little bigger than the one inch. As you can see it's a little bit bigger. So here we go. So once they're all cut out, I will ink around using a Distress ink and one of a um, cosmetic wedges that you buy at a dollar store. Or I've made one myself. This is a cork from a wine bottle and I've glued the hook part of the velcro on it and then I just cut out circles from acrylic felt that you can buy in the dollar store as well and I just put it on here and I will be inking around each of them so that the edge is de de defined so that you can see where all the circles are. Okay so once I've inked all around I will fold them in half and I will place them inside each other. So by doing that I'll be using Aline's Taki glue and I'll just add a little dab of glue on the edge over here on one of the corners and slip it into this one. So now I want to be careful how wide am I going to make the space in between. Let's have a look here. Oh, it's about good here. And I'm aiming for eight, but I was doing that before too, and then I ended up doing nine. Just how far you place them from each other. I didn't got all the, this is the edge of the envelope, so I would like to hide that in the middle instead of on the outside. Last one is a bit tricky. So I have to fold it over this one, the first one, close it, open this one up, and scoot it in between if there's still room to do that. Don't worry. Oh, as you can see, it's not an exact circle, but hey, it's handmade, not by a machine. There you go. Now, I will show you one that. So, here. This is the back. I did not have inked the edges up, so now the whole center is kind of disappearing, which might be a look you were going to go for, so that doesn't, you know, you can go either way. But I kind of like this idea here. All right, so this was it for today. It's a quick one, and uh, they don't all have to be that long. And I might want to do a few more of these short ones. And uh, thank you for watching. See you next one. Bye.